Hi, I'm Aaron Embry with Pacific Sports Warehouse. Today, we're at the Serena Valley Racquetball and Fitness Center in San Diego, California, and I'm gonna show you how to hit a forehand ceiling ball. You hit a ceiling ball when you're in trouble in the rally and you need to buy time to get back into center court, or the person has hit a good defensive shot and you need to buy time to get back into center. So anytime you're in trouble, think about using the ceiling, it's your best friend. What you're gonna do is you're gonna start with your racket, laying back this way. Not the traditional forehand with the racket up, but the racket's gonna lay slightly flat. Now you're gonna take a small step and you're gonna throw your racket up the directions of the lights near the front wall. Basically, you're gonna aim three to five feet from the front wall on the ceiling. It'll look like this. And what you would like is the ball to come back and hit the side wall about two and a half to three feet high. Higher than that, it comes off the back wall for a setup. If you're missing the back wall, if your ball's not coming all the way to the back wall, then you're hitting it too shallow and the player can then have an offensive opportunity to hit the ball. So you want to keep it so they have to hit it above their shoulder, causing a weak return. And that's how you hit a ceiling ball. I'm Aaron Embry with Pacific Sports Warehouse. You can check out my personal website at playrball.com.